watching the 30-day preview videos over at eddales 30 daychallengecom and Ed Dale is quite a Macintosh enthusiast. Uh, he was doing a screen capture of a little icon to post it into his blog and he has this neat little application on his Macintosh that will allow him to capture the file and then FTP it to a server. He wasn't sure if anything in the Windows world would do this well, just last week, or right around Thanksgiving, I was got a couple of emails from some uh, subscriptions that I'm on that told me about a free version of Snagit from TechSmith. TechSmith is the same company that makes Camtasia. So I went and got the Snagit download, and I'll give you a link to that at the bottom of this video. Also, there's a way to get the key so that you can use this version of Snagit. And what Snagit will do, it will capture a lot of different things and do a lot of different things after the capture. This time though, we're going to capture an image, as you can see right here, from a region on a web page. We're going to output it to the web. So first of all, all I have to do now that that's all set up is capture. I'm going to grab an icon of the Snagit product. I'm going to resize that. to about 100 wide and now I'm going to click web and send it to my server just have to name it and I'm giving it a PNG extension Connecting, sending, renaming, it's done. So now I can just cancel unless I want to save this to my local system. So here I am in my WordPress blog, ready to edit a new post. This one is specifically addressed to Ed Dale. And there's no malice intended. I just think it's cool that we can do this. And I think it's cool that he showed us how to do it. I'm going to open up my image editor box. And this is the picture that I just sent up there. I'm going to put a border around it and some space. For some reason, when you move it in here, it changes and you lose the picture. So here's the picture and there's the post. So if you're wanting to get a free utility called Snagit, uh, click on the links below this posting in the video in the window and there's another link that will help you go get a registration key also. And hopefully TechSmith doesn't mind the business.